And so, welcome everyone to my very first Boku no Hero Academia, the strongest hero video. My name is Zekun Kalzo, and I welcome you to my very first summoning video of, of DNHA, the strongest hero. And so, let me tell you about something on why I am playing, why I'm playing this game. Because um, at, um, when I first watched Boku no Hero, and into season 1, into season 4, I haven't watched season 5 yet, and it was a great anime. So I fell in, I not fell in love, but like I really like the anime, just like how I like it, uh, like and admire it, so yeah. And the same goes to Boku no Hero. And so since I uh, really want to try to play a gacha game of Boku no Hero, you know, like the like Genshin, SAO, Dragon Ball, Seven Deadly Sin, Grand Cross, and I did remember I did remember I saw a YouTube video of Boku no Hero Academy at the Strongest Hero on YouTube. Um, but then I was really interested in Boku no Hero. After I watched the anime, damn, I'm really interested. So when I watched through the video, and I realized it's also a gacha game, a 3D, a 3D action fighting game, also the open world that you can call it with people. And so yeah, and for today's video, it will be my very first summoning video on Boku no Hero Academia, the strongest hero. And so let me show you something. Let me show you about the summon. I won't show you my characters because it will spoil what will happen. You know, it will spoil, it will spoil the future content for the part of this video. And so, as you guys can see on... Okay, by the way, before we uh, continue the video, if you, can, if you can hear, like, somebody laughing on the background, I'm sorry. That's my, uh, my mother. <laughs> I'm talking to her friends. And so, let's continue. As you guys can see up here, um, at 7, around 7, slash 10, 30, 60, that, that tells you on what hero, uh, what, uh, a rarity of hero that you can get. So at the 10 one, you can guarantee to get a duplicate or a new B tier hero. And for 30, as you expect, uh, an A tier hero, which is epic. And the sick at the 60, you could get an S tier hero, guarantee, which means like a legendary, something like that. So, oh, <coughs> excuse me about that. So the B tier hero that we have right now is the basic beginners to heroes: Deku, Kaminari. Kirishima and the A2 hero Minera, Uraraka, Ida, and Asui Osui. <laughs> and the S2 hero that we have, oh, oh, this is the base banner by the way. So the hero that we have on the base banner is Momo, uh, Tokuyami, Shoto, and Bakugo. And so I will tell you about and on who is my first S2 Kuroki. Okay, I'll spoil it. <laughs> but yeah, as you guys can hear what I, what I accidentally say, yeah, my first S tier, S tier, um, S tier hero was Todoroki Shoto. But um, I will, I will get him on this video because I already got him when I start playing this game. Around the tutorial, a complete tutorial and stuff, and when we just start summoning, I got five tickets. I think I make a multi win just for just for the tutorial, and I got five more tickets from the. I don't remember where when I got the five tickets, so let me just show you clearly. Up here, around here, or around here, around this section, or around the login section. I forgot to close my notification, but yeah, it's nothing bad. It's nothing to. It's nothing bad. It's nothing to seriously expose publicly. So that's fine. This is what the priority. Where's the login button? Up here. Okay, this one. Alright, so I don't remember where I got the other 5 tickets, so easy to explain when I was doing the 5 ticket summons. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> it's fine, um, it's fine if, if that's being seen on this video. Oh my god, what the heck's going on here? <laughs> There's something going on on my friend's Discord server. So, so let me continue where I left off, like back to the topic. So when I start playing uh, Boku no Hero, I got 5 tickets, and then when I do 5 uh, five singles just for fun, just to get some new heroes. And you can get fragments, 1 piece fragment of a, B tier, A tier, S tier, right? So on my 5th single, when I was about to end, I got my very first S tier hero, which is this guy over here. My favorite side character or main character on Boku no Hero, Todoroki Shoto. And his voice actor has also been, uh, it's also Yuji Kaji, so, and that voice, Ellen Yeager, uh, Meliodas, and more, that I don't know. But the mostly I know is Yuji Kaji, and uh, no, sorry, the mostly I know is Meliodas and Eren. So in this, in this, in, for this summoning video, I'll be showing you on 
who is my second S tier hero. I won't be showing you my characters because it will spoil the content. And so I'll see you guys on that part of the video when I review it. ナンバーワンヒーローになるのはこの俺だ And welcome back, everyone. As you guys can see, after, after you watch this, if you, if you guys watch this summon, my second ST here was Bakugo Kaski. Um, you guys did see that like, I was riding on, I was riding like Momo, <laughs> because you know who doesn't love Momo? Momo's like the best wife. Creator, yeah, see, Momo's like the best wife in it to me, right? To me, to me, Momo is like the best wife. Uraka is also the best wife, so yeah, like, it's like Boku no Hero ha uh, every girl, not mostly everybody, like, you know what I mean, but every girl in that anime is like best wife, but there's just one girl that I don't like, just one. Yeah, uh, I won't spoil you guys, I won't spoil you guys about the anime, but I'll just, I'll just continue to my summoning, summoning topic of the video. And then you guys can see I got so before I start summoning, right, I have a feeling uh, well, I, w uh, I would take any SD character, it doesn't matter if Bakugo or anybody, I would take it, but what I mostly want at that time was Momo. And for some reason in my heart, like I feel, why I feel that I, can add, I actually would get Bakugo and then I got it. I have a feeling and that might seem true, but I don't mind, I don't mind getting an SD in Bakugo because the funny thing is, because the feature limited character band we have right now is All of Might. He has returned because last night or I think it was last night. I think last night and last night or two days ago. No, no, I'm sorry. It was last night. Uh, there was a main tennis around 2 p.m. to 6 p.m. I don't know what's that for. And in the next thing in the morning, when I when I look through the banners and boom, All Might is here. So the funny thing is, I got I got Bakugo like this. That summoning so video was yesterday. And I put on internal, and I'm sorry about that because it was at night, so I didn't want to really talk much. And so, what's the funny thing is, before All Might came back, the feature limited uh, rate up character was Bakugo, and I actually got Bakugo on the basement. How funny is that? And so, yeah, I'm sorry for just being a short video because, um, um because I already planned for this just to be a summary video. But don't worry guys, on my next video of Boku no Hero that I can be as a strong hero, I will be playing PvP either or Collaborative War or Yamina. So, let me explain to you how Collaborative War works. So, okay, I swore that I was 33,000 this time. And Collaborative War, like those tickets. And so, in Collaborative War, um, it's really similar... This game, Boku no Hero, is really similar to One Punch Man, except One Punch Man is like a 2D... A 2D game, a 2D action strategy game. 
Well, Broken and Healer is a 3D action game, open world, and also co-op, cooperative, or co-op, you can co-op with other players. So on the collaborative war, it's like, um, I think you guys might can search on the video, but I don't want to use my coins right now because I'm not going to show the video. I can, I can explain briefly everything on my next video. So easy to say, um, collaborative war, you can't do anything, you just gotta depend on your character to do the fight, which means they will fight automatically. And on arena, and on arena is basically an action fighting, which you can move, you can fight, and switch. You might, you guys might can see on the other, the other YouTubers who do this video, do some PvP videos. But I will do my PvP video on the next video, and I'm gonna tell you guys, I'm, I'm gonna tell you guys and uh, explain briefly everything about PvP uh, on my, on my explanation, of course. So I just wanna say thank you all for watching this video. And as you guys can see on uh, on my intro, I made a new intro and I have my own template and I hope you guys like that. And we will be going to the up to my upcoming new outro. So let me as I'm just gonna say thank you all for watching this video and I'll see you guys on my next Boku no Hero Academia, this one is Hero video, which is the PvP the PvP gameplay. So I'm gonna make some bit of research on what one on what I should play because I can't you know I can't understand Chinese. Which one is rank and which one is base? Or I don't know what's the I don't know what's this for. So yeah. And I'll see you guys I'll see you guys on my next on my next video. Thanks for watching. Sayonara.